Mackey Motors in Lake City is the place to find new and certified used vehicles along with a knowledgeable and helpful sales staff. Find new roads at Mackey Motors in Lake City. We're talking here today with the Carroll Boys and Swim team as they are heading down to the state meet coming up on Saturday. We're going to start off with a Jonathan Dozier who's in four events uh, coming up on Saturday, a couple of individual events as well as uh, to the both of the relays that advance down. Jonathan, first of all, congratulations on a terrific season. Thank um, you. What did it feel like on Saturday when you knew you were in in four different events? Uh, a lot of pressure uh, was relieved. Uh, just we were eating at Buffalo Wild Wings and then Deb told us the results and it was kind of nice. Now I can just kind of relax and swim at state. So just give it all I have. So. How long after the meet, uh, you guys, as you said, sitting in Buffalo Wild Wings, how long after the meet did you actually take for you to find out that you had uh, qualified in all four? I'd say like hour and a half, two hours, something like that. So. How excruciating was that hour and a half or two hours? Or were you able to kind of keep your mind off it a little bit? I was kind of able to keep my mind off of it. These guys are a lot of fun, so I was kind of, <laughs> I kind of just joked around and stuff like that. I think I was pretty sure that the 50 was in, but the 100 fly was just definitely on edge, and I definitely wanted to swim again at state. I wanted to swim the 100 fly again at state, so. What's it going to be like going down there this senior year, and what will you take away from, you know, the past years to be able to use to your advantage coming up on Saturday? Uh, I'm just going to give it everything I have. I mean, it's. It's gonna look a little different. I mean, besides, I mean, the fifth. I mean, uh, prelims and finals. Prelims Friday night, and then uh, finals on Saturday. But I mean, I'm just gonna give it everything I have. I mean, it's the senior year, so I shouldn't be too nervous. But what do you got to do Friday night in the prelims for the two individual events to be able to get back into the pool with those on Saturday? Uh, 53. I'm ranked number 16 right now. Yeah. Um, I basically just have to go my personal best. Um, I swam a 22-11. Swam a 22-11 at uh, Districts. My personal best is a 21-9-7. So if I go fast, if I go faster than my personal best, I should end up in like the A final, hopefully. So and then the 100 fly. I mean, I don't really have anything to lose. I'm I'm ranked number 25th. So I'm just gonna give it everything I have. What's it like to get to hang out with this group of guys and get to swim with them at state? It's awesome. I'm not ready for it to be over yet. <laughs> Got a good story that you can actually share with us about this group of guys? <laughs> uh, not not that I not, not that I can think of at the moment. <laughs> All of it combined is just unmatchable. So. Well, I tell you what. Congratulations on a great season and career. Best of luck down in State and Iowa City this weekend. Thank you. you Thanks, Jeff. Let's move Kyle Sundrup in here now. And Kyle, he gets himself down in three events as well, both the relays and also an individual event as well. Kyle, congratulations. Um, Jonathan said it took you guys about an hour to maybe two hours to kind of find out you had made it. What was going through your mind as you were waiting on Saturday to see if you made it? Um, well, especially since last year, uh, I had I got quarantined uh, Friday before districts last yep. year, and it was really unfortunate, especially because I was ranked pretty high yep. in the hunter backstroke, and especially as a freshman, um, it would have been really cool if I could have qualified. So I don't feel like there is a lot of pressure on me to qualify again this year. Um, so just sitting there at Buffalo Wild Wings after the meet, you know, I was like, I had a good swim, dropped about eight tenths of a second, second, something like that. And I was like, I hope it's enough. And luckily, um, Deb told me I qualified. Uh, just barely snuck in, though, 29th out of 32. So I mean, I'll take it. And I'm just gonna leave it all out there on Saturday or on Friday night. Um, just also try to shoot for the record up on the board. Um, so that's just my goal there. What do you need to do to get um, I need a 55-77. Um, right now, I have a 52 or 56-2 right now. So I just need to drop about half a second. So. Um, well, I mean, definitely, dis I mean, it's going to be a lot, the environment at State is going to be a lot different. It's going to be really, very uh, energetic, really hype. Um, also, going off a good taper, um, and there's not going to be a lot, of, not as much pressure, so I think I can use that and just kind of push myself a little harder, drop that half a second. I know you're never going to be able to make up for, for being quarantined yeah. and missing it, but what does this mean to you to get it go down now? Um, I just think, I, I mean, Obviously, I mean, it was an accomplishment just to qualify again this year. Just like I said, there's a lot of pressure. And so, like, I'm just not taking this opportunity for granted. I mean, I know there's a lot of people that don't qualify for state. So, I mean, I'm just, you know, just leave it all out there. 
What are you looking forward to with the relays with these four guys? Um, well, we have a we have a great relay. Um, I mean, we're not necessarily ranked super high, but you know, that's kind of the the idea of it. Is you know, we have nothing to lose. We're gonna just leave it all out there, swim our fastest, hopefully PR. Uh, we have a good group of guys, so I think we can definitely do that. Well, Kyle, I appreciate you joining us. Congratulations yep. on a great season and getting there in three events. Yep, thank you. Sam, appreciate you joining us, uh, both the uh, 200 and the uh, 400 uh, free relays uh, with this group of four guys here. Um, what's it feel like to get a go down this state? Well, I mean, I've been swimming with like two of these guys for like my whole life, Jonathan and Kyle. We did cast since we were young. It's really cool being able to go to state with them. I mean, should be fun. What was it like for you when you found out? Was it, was it a, a surprise or did you feel really confident that you guys had made it in both of those relays? Um, I wasn't really surprised when we made it. Like, I figured we would because, like, in the rankings we were, like, up there. But, I mean, we did, like, squeak by a little bit. We did uh, improve our time by a lot for our 400 free relay. We dropped, like, seven seconds, I think. So that's that's cool. What's this week of practice been like getting ready for state? How different is it than even getting ready for the state qualifying week? So we've been tapering a lot for uh, this week and last week. Uh, the week before it, though, is hell week. So that was, like, just all out so it's been nice having taper and then we're dropping our yards every day until state so not too hard let's talk about the blonde hair all you guys have uh, who came up with the idea um so it's kind of been like a tradition for the swimmers you go to state and you'll see like the weirdest things like bald arrow like mohawks all that stuff so i don't really want to shave my head so we did bleach um we did that for like four years i guess i don't know do you like the look no. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. What are your goals for Saturday? And, and, and beyond just the swimming, what are you going to soak in and try to remember about being down there? Well, definitely the hotel. I'm sure we'll have a ton of fun there. At State, I want to be able to um, swim like better times. So I did get a 51 split during districts. I want to try to get like a 50 flat. Uh, for the four, 200 free relay, I swam like a 23, but I think it would be cool if I could go like a 22, 21 around there. Just soak up, like hitting up all my friends, I guess. Sort of last year, so should be nice. Okay, well, congratulations on a great season and career. Appreciate you joining us here today. Best of luck coming up Saturday. Man. Thank you. You bet. Let's move Tristan Blair, the final guy out of our group in here. And, and Tristan, what's this feeling right, like right now, and, and how you've been able to kind of control the emotion as this week goes on? Um, Pretty unreal, I guess. I mean, I worked all season. I mean, our entire team worked all season. And we just put it all out there on Saturday and ended up getting it. So it's pretty, feels really good, like accomplished. So, yeah. You knew the two relays had a really good chance of making it there. What was it on this past Saturday at the state qualifying meet that you think got you guys through? Probably just the energy, like our relays, they bring like really high energy. And I feel like, because John, obviously, he was like, we're gonna go, let's go guys. I feel like he was just able to like uplift us, so we were able to like go faster and all that stuff. So yeah. I'd say good good teammates helped out a lot. So what's the biggest thing you're looking forward to beyond the swimming um, down at the state nature? The memories. A f pretty good time. You know, last year went as an alternate, it was pretty fun, so I'm looking forward to that again. It <laughs> should be pretty fun, so yeah. Did you use some of being down there last year to kind of keep the nerves? a little bit this year what did you learn from last year that you think will help you there's a lot of people there and like it's a, there's a lot of energy but I feel like you just gotta relax swim your best race and get it done so hopefully it goes good so yeah what's practice been like this week really easy we've just taken it slow not pushing ourselves too hard so you don't you know obviously strain anything so what's the main thing you focused on in the pool this week Probably relay exchanges, so we get faster, faster, better, better starts. Just relay exchanges. So Buffalo Wild Wings was this last Saturday. What's going to be the the food of choice for you guys down at State this week when it's all over? Probably a lot of Italian food, like carbs. But I think probably steak houses on Saturday after the meet. We'll see how it goes. So yeah. <laughs> Congrats on a great season and career. Appreciate you joining us here today. Best of luck Saturday. Thank you.